Hey guys, welcome back to 40 Plus Life, or welcome if you are new. I'm Veronica, and today I'm gonna show you my grocery haul for this week, for, uh, for this week, maybe next week as well, we'll see. Um, and this grocery haul I got at Walmart. Now, I'm not a big Walmart fan at all. In fact, I don't like Walmart. <laughs> I refuse to go inside of a Walmart, so I did do the pickup. So, once in a while I do like to order stuff, because I can get it cheap and depending on what I'm getting and and so that's why so I'll do the pickup but I will not go inside I am a snob when it comes to that unfortunately I prefer Target but certain things I totally get it Walmart is very good but I just cannot stand going inside probably I you know honestly I don't even like shopping in general so maybe that's probably a big reason why I don't like going in a Walmart the total for this order was $90.23 it was supposed to be 98 because I was supposed to get four bottles of the 16 ounce propane gas tanks, but they unfortunately were out of stock. So that got taken out. And so my haul ended up being $90.23. And I'll go ahead and show you guys now. All right, so here is my grocery haul, a different angle than normal. So I'm just gonna go right into it. First up, I got a red bell pepper. I've got, this is more of a splurge item. When these were in the $3 range, I would love to stock up on these, but all the Morningstar Farms are now pretty expensive and four, I think four, almost $5. So I only get them once in a while um, as a splurge item, like I said. So I got these vegetarian corn dogs along with the vegetarian bacon, which I love. And I can use these for all kinds of things, not just as bacon, but as chopped up into to replace regular bacon like I do in my fried rice. I got a cucumber, two Roma tomatoes, two 18 packs of eggs, a big thing of the buttermilk waffles, Usually I get the Eggo waffles, but I thought, hey, these were much cheaper, so I thought I'd try them out. And then moving on over, for some reason, I also decided to get this pancake and waffle mix, so try it out. And change things up a bit, get some yellow cake, along with some buttercream frosting. We'll see how that goes. Well, I got one pack of the hash browns, because I still like to have them every so often one pack of blueberry frozen blueberries a pack of baby spin or spinach not the baby spinach what's this oh green onions i got a 16 ounce pack of shredded cheese and then i got four boxes of mac and cheese and i got four boxes of pasta noodles two ziti two rotini I got four bananas that are already looking kind of ripe. I don't know why they gave me that, but that's okay. I end up cutting them up and putting them in the freezer anyway, so it's fine. Two red onions. I got a thing of sourdough bread. Where am I? I decided to try these little mini cherry pies. They're so cute and tiny, so I got two of those. And then I got some, oh, can you see, grape tomatoes. I got a total of six Coke Zeros of these bottles, two liter bottles, but I don't want to carry them all in because I store them in the garage, so I'm showing you two of them. And then I got three bottles of my diet iced tea that I love. And then just walk on over here. And then I got a pack of... What's this called? Toilet paper. <laughs> so I got a big 18 pack. So this haul is, I think, was supposed to be more, you know, more stocking up on stuff because, you know, if you saw my last prepping video, then you'll see, you know, that's kind of what I do. So even if I have a lot of stuff in my pantries and whatnot, I do like to keep stocking up and rotating. So that's what all this is. And one thing I forgot to mention, I also bought two 40 packs of the water bottles. So I got two of those, so that's 80 water bottles total. Those things are heavy. I did not want to carry them in, so they're in my garage. 
So <laughs> I'll post a picture though somewhere here if you really want to see it for those that don't believe me. <laughs> and I think that's it. So yeah, that is my grocery haul from Walmart and it was $90.23. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like videos like this, please do comment below and let me know. If you are new here, please do subscribe and, and please do press the like button if these are videos that you do like. Um, and that'll be it. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.